The U.N. Security Council 2178, adopted last year, requires member states to cooperate in stemming the flow of foreign fighters to terrorist organizations. So we have an obligation, as well as a compelling interest, to work together in ways that fully respect basic human rights, but to criminalize violent extremist activity, to secure borders, to share information, and to implement other measures to curb the recruitment of foreign terrorist fighters. And that's why today we are launching a new initiative to address the life cycle of radicalization to violence. This initiative will improve our ability to address every part of the terrorist cycle, from the start when young people get grabbed by proselytizers who infect their minds, to the end where governments and communities have to decide how do you best handle returning foreign fighters. The goal is to provide vulnerable governments with the tools and the knowledge that they need to prevent radicalization in the first place and to disengage individuals who have become radicalized so they might be reintegrated into their communities.